right, YouTube, it's time for a little exposing action. Nothing personal. It's just business. It's not fair how certain content cre creators just... Have y'all ever noticed that sometimes the system will, like, put people that you didn't even subscribe to in your subscriptions? So I want to show y'all something about CIA agents and what they do. And a lot of guys don't realize on the radio and on YouTube that I listen to everything. And a lot of these guys will unknowingly confess that they are indeed CIA agents or they used to be. So let's look at what a CIA agent, CIA agent does. It says, what does a CIA agent do? Gather gathering and analyzing data that he that could be important to national security so they say but anyway so they say the people that they're censoring are not a threat usually to national security it's like influential speakers if you will so so what they do sometimes remember J Edgar Hoover uh, worked very closely with the CIA and he was an FBI agent. He came up with a lot of the concepts that are used to this day, like the COINTELPRO list. It says, gathering and analyzing data that could be important to national security, reviewing foreign newspapers, magazines, and other media sources, Facebook, Instagram, YouTube for information related to potential intelligence. What better way are they doing this than having their own uh, pose as YouTube creators, content creators, examining satellite imagery to monitor potentially threatening activity? The people, listen, man. And you, most of y'all have been trained to be uh, guinea pigs, if you will. You think everybody that brings a unique approach or extra knowledge is crazy? Everybody ain't crazy, y'all. That's just a dismissive tactic that has been carefully implemented through the years by the CIA. The Central Intelligence Agency is one of the largest U.S. federal agencies. Now look what it says. I'm just going to let you read it for yourself. I'm going to keep moving along. So what does a CIA agent do? That's what I already read. I see this right. Give me a second, man. This stuff just makes you mad sometimes. Because there are a lot of content creators on YouTube that mean well. That they just want to get their thousand subscribers and get some compensation for their videos and I know content creators I know they're good guys but let's say you in gaming they're gonna put the CIA uh, agents channels first no matter what you do it's just how it is you just can only hope that YouTube allows you to get fair coverage and to get fair exposure, which they usually don't. They had a glitch in their system some years back while I was in Texas. And it was quite encouraging to me because it was telling how many people were watching the videos at the moment. I guess somebody within the organization made a mistake or something. But I noticed that 
way more people were watching my videos at the time than D Joel Osteen, T.D. Jakes. I was blowing them out of the water. Like, it was very, very encouraging. It said, XX, it was basically saying, such and such number watching right now. That's what it said, watching now. And then I looked the next day and none of the view counts were going up. So I called Google. I called them for months. I finally got through and the woman told me that my view counts appeared to be unrealistic. So, uh, they froze them, basically. But I know just from my lifetime that I'm a very entertaining guy. And people that work for work with me and know me, they'll tell you that I'm a quite, I have a very strong, good sense of humor. I look at this as business, like I don't really get a chance to show who I am on this YouTube because I'm too busy looking at the way they censor me. But this is why they censor me. See this? This is why. Because I'm not an agent. See, if you're not an agent, you can still make it, but them agents going to make it before you do. And just listen real closely and watch their hand gesture. Some of them are not only agents, but they're also Freemasons. They're also uh, linked. Some of the there's some of the relatives of, of very prominent people. There's other things to this. There's a lot to it, and and and. They'll get you out of the way if you start saying too much on here. Like, it, YouTube used to have some very, like, it was a guy, uh, Black Masonic. Like, his video, then you had Ring of Power. Both you can't find anymore. Then you had Bill Cooper. You had uh, all these people. John Todd. They all disappear. When they when you start exposing this, you're really in danger. And I'm not gonna keep talking about this because it's just not worth it. But I wanted to give y'all a little bit. I'm gonna do a little expose. I'm gonna do a couple exposes for you. See, most of y'all are programmed to look down on people that you should be clinging to like a sponge. And it usually happens if you're not connected to God. Like some people think they are, but they're not really, because they reject the true people of God a lot of times. But you program to do so. You programmed to judge by outward appearance, even though the Bible told you not to. You still do it. And here's why. Because y'all been programmed. That's why they call it radio programming, television programming. Y'all know the, the girl, the black girl. Um who was very instrumental in getting all these black people to come out and vote against Trump. Like Biden was, was so good. To be honest with you, I don't trust no politician like that. But I think Trump would keep, you know, being a conservative and knowing both sides, knowing the liberal side, knowing the conservative side. Freedom if you want freedom, if you want to be able to make the money that you can make, have whatever you want to have, capitalism, uh, your kids to to uh, to have freedom of school choice and freedom this way, freedom that way, able to buy as much property as you can afford, um, able to think how you choose to think, you have to vote for conservatives. 
you have to, because when you start voting for for liberals, a lot of y'all y'all thought y'all was really doing something talking about how racist Trump was, even though Biden is more racist than Trump, and so is Bill Clinton. Yeah, I thought y'all was really doing something, and look what we have here. Corona, now people losing their jobs. Well, we ain't gonna even get into that. We ain't gonna get into that. People are not better off. We'll just end it with that. They're worse off. We don't need no virtual currency. We don't need no digital currency. <laughs> How do those things benefit the people? Hmm? Tell me. Tell me. How do they benefit people? They don't. They benefit people who try to control other people. So... You content creator, you smaller content creators, if you make a video and you only have five views, three views, just know that you're not, if you're not an agent, that's more than likely to happen. You're not going to get your thousand subscribers. You're not going to get the views on most of your videos. Sometimes they'll give you let you have like two or three videos to get a lot of views and then they're gonna censor all the rest of your videos and shadow ban them push them to the back the tags you when you tag a video it's supposed to every time that word is typed in the search engine your video is supposed to come up but not in this unfair system it don't happen so don't get discouraged over this and all these platforms are the same. They're all doing it. BitChute just wanted you to think that they weren't censoring. But BitChute, I can't even log into my BitChute anymore. After I made some videos on certain stuff. So they not the answer either. Don't. They probably wouldn't be surprised if BitChute and YouTube is ran by the same people. They ain't no better. They just want you to think that. So yeah, don't get too far into these content creators. As a matter of fact, it's a couple of them that, that they appear to be very humble and they don't really, uh, they don't really do what I'm talking about uh, or they don't really experience what I'm talking about. But that don't mean that they not CIA agents. Because some of them, like, you, you start noticing they get, like, real cocky. Like, the more they grow, the more cocky they get. And I watch a lot of people. Because I'm the type, if you say, if I hear about something you said, I might watch it. Or if I hear, or if, if like, I like what you're saying, I'll watch but some of these guys are getting real cocky. Listen, man, you be honest. Anybody that's putting down other smaller YouTube creators, like I heard one guy say, it's because your content ain't good. Hey, you know who you are who said that. Let me ask you a question. Apart from if you're an agent, apart from you being an agent, would you be so popular? Because well, you already done prove, you already done expose yourself that you don't really live by what you're talking about. A person that's talking about game supposed to show game. But if you're talking about ha having game and then you get in front of women and you, you freeze up, come on now. But you want to talk about other YouTube creators, how they ain't good enough. Are you an agent? Be honest, man. We men. Are you a CIA agent? Yeah. Yeah. This me you talking to. This Prophet Howard. It don't matter what YouTube think of me. It's what God think of me. And a lot of these, these uh, my phone is always doing mysterious things. These people already know what time it is. That's why they always spying on me. I get, I done got calls from, well, we ain't gonna even get into that. 
They know what they be doing. Thanks for watching. This is the Truth Man channel. If they allow you to, like, share, subscribe, comment on the video.